third edition has gained more and more attendees, participants. It has become an important event on an annual basis. It has now a very good reputation in the region. And I think that uh, we are doing now history for the oil and gas in Egypt. It's the largest petroleum show in North Africa and maybe one of the largest in Africa now. Uh, the companies are invested here, big ones are coming more. Uh, so BP and E&I have been here established, Total is here, Shell is coming, Exxon's interested. And Egypt's going to move from being a regional consumer of energy. It's now going to be a hub and an exporter and that changes all the dynamics of the Mediterranean. So I think everybody wants to be part of it. What you clearly see in Egypt these days is that you see a very active government. You know, you see a very active minister who wants Egypt to be a, a key player in the oil and gas market, and he seems to be successful. So credit to him and his team. found really good you know step change actually from last year to this year in terms of standard quality of paper content of the subject which have been tackled by the panels and uh, this is the event of all if you like the uh, collaborative spirit between the different stakeholders uh, I mean it's absolutely fantastic and I get the chance and the privilege to have you know our most senior executives, they have Egypt on their agenda. They've been here for the past three years and already they're committing to uh, more events. So Egypt is vital now for us and I believe it is vital for anybody who wants to do business in Egypt in the oil and gas and energy sector. I could see myself in like 20 years uh, being the Minister of uh, Energy in Egypt. Mm -hmm.